Hey guys, what's going on? So I had a request recently to illustrate the test that shows you how to tell if your Mark IIc is a C or a C plus, and it's called the loop test. You know, there's lots of indicators uh, between Cs and C pluses, you know, looking at the preamp boards and the transformers and other things. But, you know, because a lot of Cs over the years have been upgraded to C pluses, the only way to know for sure is to actually do the loop test. Serial numbers can be a good indicator, but from what I've seen, you know, that's not even an end all be all just because, you know, back in those days, you know, things were a little loose and a lot of them have been modded over the years. So let's do the loop test and we'll talk about some more things. So here we have a 2C plus. One of the ways you can tell a 2C versus a 2B is that on the C's and C pluses, the middle is not a push pull. Whereas on the Mark 2A's and 2B's, the base and the middle are not a push-pull. And then on Mark 3s, which I don't happen to have here today, they're all push-pull because this is the push-pull for the third channel because Mark 3s are a three-channel amp or the Mark 2s are a two-channel amp. So what you have to do is you have to go into lead mode. So you pull the lead. So you're in the lead mode. And then th the lead drive, this is your gain for your lead channel. So what you have to do is get in lead mode, take a guitar, and you have to jack in to the effects return. So you can see here, we're jacked into the effects return on the effects loop, okay? Now, when you're jacked into the effects return, the thing is, on the two Cs, your gain for your lead channel was after the effects loop. So if this was a two C, when I play a note and turn this knob, it's gonna do something because this is after the loop. On the C+, plus, this is before the effects loop. So if I play a note and I turn this knob, this isn't going to do anything because I'm jacked into the effects return and this is gonna be before the effects loop. So let's give it a shot. So I'm gonna... All right, so you can see in this case, you can see in this case that I played the note coming into the effects return. I turned the lead drive all the way up, all the way down. It had no effect on tone or gain. That means this is before the effects loop. That means this is a 2C plus. So that's the definitive way of telling what you have. Um, you know, just looking at them, it can be hard to tell because twos and threes, you know, a lot of them really kind of look alike if you don't know what you're looking for. So a couple other things that I'll mention since we're here. Um, for example, if you want to tell if it's 2A or B versus C or C plus or 3. So you already talked about the push pulls, but if you look at the back of the amp, the, the 2A did not have an effects loop, whereas the 2B has an effects loop. So this is a 2B. And of course, the 2Cs and C pluses and 3s all have an effects loop. Another way that you can tell is the twos have metal nuts on everything back here, whereas the threes have plastic nuts on everything back here. So yeah, between those things, those are a few indicators that you can see is, is this a 2A, a 2B, a 2C, or a C plus by doing the test, or is it a Mark III? So hope that helps, and let me know if you guys have any questions. Thanks.